CAT grade control for wheel tractor scrapers includes factory integrated machine control systems specifically designed to help move material efficiently. Wheel tractor scrapers use sequence assist, load assist, and grade control. The operator can decide which systems to use for different earth moving needs and can change operating preferences for different applications and job sites. To begin, set up sequence assist in an area that safely allows machine movements. With the parking brake off, press the load sequence assist switch on the keypad. When the sequence assist is active, the green light is on. Begin by cycling through each of the four sequences, load, haul, spread, and return by pressing the sequence assist button on the implement control. On an open bowl scraper, check the bowl and apron height settings. On an elevating scraper, check the bowl height and elevator speed settings. If the settings of all the cycles are correct, proceed to using the system. Bowl, apron, and elevator settings for any or all sequences can be changed. Press the sequence cycle key you would like to change. Move the position or speed control to the new setting and then press and hold the corresponding sequence switch until the green light flashes. Sequence assist settings can be modified for operator preferences. Open the apron more for deeper cuts, such as when push pulling or push loading with a tractor. For an elevating scraper, change elevator speed for different ground speeds. Manually overriding the apron or bowl height, ejector position, or elevator speed will temporarily disable automatics. Automatic movement of the machine will resume when you toggle to the next sequence. Load assist is only available on open bowl scrapers and can reduce workload and tire slip. It can also be used as a training aid for inexperienced operators. Load assist can be used with or without sequence assist. If using both, Activate both the load assist and the sequence assist keys. With the machine in second gear, press the load assist button on the implement control. The cutting edge will automatically raise or lower depending on the tractor speed to attempt to keep the machine moving steadily. For a smoother cut area, engage the cutting edge and begin to load the bull before enabling the load assist automatics. When you push the sequence assist button to cycle to ready to haul, the load assist is automatically turned off. Load assist is preset to take full advantage of tractive effort in the widest range of materials. If the material does not fit in that range or if there is a need to take shallow cuts without the use of automatics, disable the load assist. On open bowl scrapers, grade control, load assist, and sequence assist can be used together. When grade control is active, the load assist button also activates grade control. Automatic grade control will keep the cutting edge above the target grade by raising the bowl. Use the grade control display to select a working surface. When there is a valid surface, there is an indication of target grade on the display's light bars and graphics. The distances to these horizontal and vertical targets can be offset by the keypad or directly from the display. For example, you can increment fill areas up to allow for compaction and final trim, or increment down in cut areas to take out layered cuts. On elevating scrapers, the grade control automatics will drive the cutting edge to follow the surface elevations. The operator must choose when to use automatics to ensure the machine is capable of making that grade pass to avoid stalling. Each part of the CAT grade control for wheel tractor scrapers can be used independently. For certain situations, turning off one or more systems is necessary. Using these systems when conditions allow will increase efficiency. There are additional videos for operation of the grade control display. For full operational instructions, refer to the operational and maintenance manual provided with the machine.